pleasure and a privilege to be back here in Manila exactly one year and one day after the Global Peace Festival of 2007. We have come full circle. We Filipinos are proud to welcome you to our great nation and we look forward to more opportunity for peace throughout your country, my country, in every country, and peace throughout the world. I would like to thank you all for making us, the Office of the Presidential Advisor on the Peace Process, a partner of this Global Peace Festival. Just this September, the Philippines celebrated the National Peace Consciousness Month. The importance of peace must always be in every man's heart and mind as citizens of the world. In the spirit of this Global Peace Festival, we can overcome many problems in our hands. I don't see any point why we should be spending millions investing in infrastructure, tourism, the trade and industry, if we do not have an environment of peace. Mindanao is one third of the Philippines. It's the southern island facing Indonesia and Malaysia. The uh, people in Mindanao are Muslims, Christians, and Lumads. And the Muslims, they have been fighting for their own homeland for almost 400 years. We could feel the uh, warm welcome put up by the uh, Muslims and the indigenous tribes and the Christians together, living in that uh, peace village. As ambassadors of peace, our presence is badly needed in a conflict-ridden area. Now we are trying to bring peace to Mindanao. And one of the most successful initiatives is this Global Peace Festival. People in Mindanao will be convinced that they are accepted, we understand their situation, and that we are willing to help them resolve the conflict. I think we succeeded in proving to the whole world that we are peace-loving people in Mindanao. The only way to change society is to prepare our youth who will become the future citizens and the future leaders of the country. I see the importance of starting to develop the culture of peace in the children. We are developing a new generation who would say no to violence, who will say no to injustice. There will be many, many, many more global peace festivals, not only in Manila, not only in the United States, not only in Paraguay, but everywhere around the world until we can spread the gospel of peace. Let us make a solemn pledge to lead the world to peace through the vision of one family under God. <laughs>